What's up fam, this is P. Roy, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to discuss how to define your coils. And when we say wash and go, we normally are talking about defining your coils. There are a ton of products out there that can help you define your coils, but I use three mainly, and these are my top favorites for defining my coils. It is so important to note that these just define your coils. These products do not create curls for you, so don't expect to see something that's not there. It only enhances the coils that you already have. So the first step in the process to make sure your hair is wet, a lot of these products do not work well without making sure your hair is wet, and I like to apply a base, my leave-in conditioner, Giovanni Direct Leave-In, my favorite of all time, and I just make sure that it's thoroughly saturated in my hair. Today I'm using the creme brulee by Alec Naturals and I'm just applying that all over my hair, making sure that I just get all of my strands. But what I'm gonna end up doing is going back in and sectioning off a piece of my hair and I'm gonna rate and smooth the product through my strands. And this will ensure clumping. This will help my hair clump together and help form my coils. Like I said, it is so important to make sure that your hair is wet and it's also important that you use enough product because sometimes we don't use enough product but then sometimes we use too much so just find that balance so that you're using enough product to clump your coils together i like to use my fingers for this process but there are other tools that you can use i'll show you a little bit later because my hair is so short on the sides i don't necessarily have to use anything else i just wet my hair apply the product and i detangle rake and smooth with my hands now in the middle, my hair is longer, so I have to take a little bit more time in that section. And because sometimes I'm impatient, that just takes too long for me. But you can see me starting from the tips of my hair, detangling, and then moving up to the roots of my hair. And it does give me great clumping. But there are times where I just wanna go a little faster. So I'll just grab a tool, like a brush or a, a tangle teaser. Now this is the Felicia Leatherwood brush. I actually was sent this from her and um, I've been liking it ever since, but I also use my tangle teaser. So either one of those products work well for me. You can use a dimming brush if you like, but you see how my curls are clumped together and by the end, this is what they look like. So I just let them dry for about mm, 80 to 90 percent and then I'll go back in with my diffuser. This diffuser attachment came with my blow dryer but my blow dryer is like way old and way cheap so you can find them at your local beauty supply stores, Walmart, Target, wherever and just get a blow dryer it has a diffuser attachment. You can use medium to high heat. I like to use high heat because I don't like to sit there for a long time and try to get my curls dry. So I use high heat and it only takes about five to seven minutes for my hair to really be dry after I use this attachment. So I go in, make sure my roots are blasted and make sure everything is good. And then you see my coils here. The last thing I like to do is to go in and shape my coils. Now there are times where I will pick out the middle and make it very high and you know, I like to wear my hair high. But since today is day one and I've missed my shrink it so much, I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna wear it out just like this. My hair is not hard at all, it's very soft to the touch. If you want a little bit more hardness, you can use gel, but make sure you get that crunch out and your coils will be super duper duper defined as you can see, before and after, amazing. So tell me, what do you guys use to define your coils? I'd love to know, leave that in the comments section below. Thank you so much for watching fam and until next time, peace. Check out how I've defined and refreshed my coils using other products and techniques. Want curls without all the shrinkage? Check out how to use these perm rods in my Perm Rod 101 video.